question seven after a new star question we've got pretty much the old style I'm just going to integrate this a big integration question we want to find the area from here from zero to okay well the first thing I don't actually know is how far I need to go there I need to know well when is y equal to zero let's do that first shall we when does zero equal 2e to the 2x minus x e to the 2x so let's factorize out the e to the 2x there um, of course this never equals zero so we can see that we're going from x equals 2 so if we get a couple of a mark there just for knowing that we need to go from 0 to 2 so we're going to try and integrate then from 0 to 2 2 e to the 2x minus x e to the 2x dx and we're going to need some methods to do this there's one way of doing it would be just to do this bit on its own so 2 e to the 2x the e's stay the same but are divided by the 2 and I'm going between 0 and 2 there so that will give me e to the 4 take away e to the 0 so that bit there is e to the 4 take away 1 I also need to integrate this bit here then integrating this bit here would need an integration by parts u equals x dv by dx equals the other bit that differentiates to give 1, that integrates to give a half e to the 2x. So we're going minus a half x e to the 2x. That was that minus there. Now I'm going to go minus minus makes it plus here, plus a half e to the 2x. quarter e to the 2x and again that needs to be between 0 and 2 doesn't it sticking in the 2 in there gives me so I've got uh, minus a half times 2 that's just so I've got minus e to the 4 plus a quarter e to the 4 and putting in the 0 that bit 0 and that bit there is just going to be a quarter uh, e to the 4 take away e to the 4 is going so I've got a quarter e to the 4 here now I've got minus 1 take away another quarter so I've got minus 5 over 4 that's my answer there you would tap it into the calculator to check as well um, you're being asked to leave it in a form of e to the 4s so I didn't need to use a calculator at any stage but there's the answer there I suppose there's an alternative way of doing this integral here rather than doing it in the two sections what you could have done is we could have just factorized it out like we did in the previous part 2 take away x lots of e to the 2x and then I've got u is equal to this and dv by dx is equal to e to the 2x and just do it as one by parts there 